I'm trying to make this clock run and I'm almost there. I'm removing the friction. I've put four sets of ball bearings in here. There's too much friction on the fork. The pallet fork moves, but it doesn't move smoothly. When the hairspring returns, it gets stopped by the pallet fork. I'm going to stop now and put some bearings on the pallet fork shaft and see if that helps reduce the friction. I've removed the dial so it can be easier to see the setup. It's working. An all 3D printed clock. I printed this clock over 10 months ago. It was advertised as a working model of a clock, but not a working clock, because it has no bearings and the shafts were all sitting in 3D printed plastic. I was hoping that as my skills improved, I could get it working. A couple of months back, I ordered some very tiny ball bearings off eBay. I haven't even installed them all and it's working. I picked bearings to go to the points that I could see the most friction on. And that's all it's taken. This clock has been hanging around on my wall so long, there's dust on it. I'm going to put the face and hands on and give it more of a wind just to watch it. Just look at that plastic hairspring. I'm really happy. I have to reward myself with some lunch now. <laughs>